South Florida fast food restaurant ordered shut after flies were seen landing in the mayo and strawberry toppings. Plus, unsanitary conditions found at a restaurant busted for cooking outside instead of inside. Here's local 10 News investigator Jeff Weinsier with tonight's Dirty Dining Report. So their entire kitchen is just out back, the fryers. We saw exactly what an inspector saw. Out back, there are two commercial fryers, an oven, a refrigerator. Up above, certainly not a commercial hood. There were exposed electrical wires. There were cooking ingredients. Last week, this place cited for using this, quote, unapproved kitchen. Feels like the fryer is on. Are you guys going to be cooking in the back? Can't say anything. The place, Ms. Dixie, the address 21000 West Dixie Highway. It's in Northeast Miami-Dade. Last week, an inspector was here, noted 20 violations, ordered the place shut for, quote, unsanitary conditions. The inspector observed a chef cooking chicken in that unapproved outside kitchen. Quote, a kitchen not protected from environmental contamination. There was chicken thawing outside. Employees were touching food. There were hand washing issues here. How come you're cooking food in the back instead of inside the kitchen? Never. You were, you were cooking, ki you were cooking chicken in the back when they were here. No cooking. If we say that we have a case of chicken in the back and we put it in. The owner denies any cooking was going on. You were using an unauthorized outside kitchen to serve people food. Even after we showed him what the inspector actually witnessed. They were cooking kitchen, cooking chicken outside. She doing everything inside, nothing happened outside. So you won't be cooking outside at all today? Absolutely not. Never. Never? You have permits for that kitchen in the back to the wiring and the electricity? For the back? No, this is why we broke everything out. You see, we already took half out, now we're taking the other half. Is that all been approved by the county? The county, we plan, we, we submit all the plans to the county. You all did? Of, you submitted plans to the county? And check in the county, we're in the process. Oh, we certainly did. First off, Miami-Dade sent an electrical inspector out immediately, called it a fire hazard, said an extension cord was being used to operate the outside kitchen, referred the situation to fire inspectors, and issued a violation. Miss Dixie had already been cited back in August for unpermitted work out back. They were operating without a certificate of use from the county. Interior renovations submitted in April were not approved. They seem to be playing by their own rules here, putting you and other tenants in this shopping center at risk. We moved to 5400 West Oakland Park Boulevard in Lauder Hill. Five violations were found at this checkers last week and the place was ordered shut. I wanted to talk to somebody about the inspection last week. Flies were landing in Mayo in strawberry topping, landing on cheese and onions. There were flies flying over cooked chicken and french fries. You need to call this number if you need to contact anybody. Flies in the mayo though? I'm sorry? Flies in the mayo, flies in the onions, oh, flies sir, in the cheese. You need to call this number. We did call the number given to us and we got absolutely no reply. All the places just mentioned were allowed to reopen following an ordered cleanup and then a reinspection. Jeff Weinsier, Local 10 News. Thank you, Jeff. For more on the restaurants ordered shut last week, simply scan the QR code on your screen using your phone's camera. It'll take you directly to our dirty dining section on our website, local10.com. And there you'll be able to see all of the violations.